so recently my favorite genre of porn has been uh, <laughs> short skinny dudes that bang tall curvy women yeah Amazon porn have you seen it it's yeah, it's, it's good yeah, I don't even get I'm just, I don't even get off to it I'm five foot four it just makes me happy to see us win <laughs> Yeah, we don't get much. Short guys, like every victory counts. Like it's, it's like an inspiration. I watch short guy porn the way old white men watching it. Rudy, I start clapping. <laughs> like I get tears in my eyes. I'm just like, yeah, you did it, little buddy. <laughs> Sucks being short. I just, uh, like, I, I recently realized the worst part about being short is just learning how to manage your own confidence. Like, showing too much, you come off like a dickhead. Not enough, you come off pathetic. Every day, I'm just... Towing that line between King Joffrey and the Bagel Boss. <laughs> yeah, you seen that video, right? He's fucking he's four nine. He's just like, "You're not my real dad." I'm like, "You're 40. Fucking pump the brakes. Making the rest, making every other short dude look. If you have to look up to yell at someone, just calm down. You don't look good. You know what I mean? Like, it, that's. That's the worst part about short dudes. It's like, stop trying to do shit to look tall. Like, it's not helping. I have a friend, he's 5'2", he buys, like, specialty short guy clothes, and it annoys me. It's like, yeah, no, it's like, he wears, like, tight pants and, like, lifted shoes. He, he gets, like, shirts with, like, smaller pockets. He's like, it makes me look proportioned. Like, you look far away. <laughs> You're here, and I'm yelling at you. Like... Short guys either look insecure or evil. Like, it's like, oh my god, this doesn't help at all. I it, look, I know what I look like. I, somewhere between like Ben Shapiro and that kid who upped the price on AIDS pills. I mean, look at this oh. face. Yeah. <laughs> it doesn't help that my hair gets all like flippy. It's like Hitler hair in the corner. Like I don't ask for that haircut. I I go to a black barber shop in West Philly. It's just what they gave me. It's, Felt like a prank. <laughs> I'm a light-skinned Hispanic. Like this is a shit life. Like this. Growing up, all I used to hear was how white I look, only to find out I don't get privilege. Like this stinks. <laughs> Feel gypped. <laughs> oh my god. Dude, being a light-skinned Hispanic does uh, like socially, it's the worst. Like other Latinos don't like you, and white people don't trust you. The only cool part is like I date black girls and like black dudes seem to respect that, and it, which is like sick. It's like points. There's nothing better than like being on a date with a girl and like you're walking along the pier and just hear like a dude behind you be like, "Hey!" Turn around, it's like a forty-year-old black dude just pointing like, "Go ahead, young bull." <laughs> I don't know if this is racist, but uh, if, <laughs> if you notice that encouragement always sounds the best when it comes out of old black people. <laughs> you ever hear an old black lady be like, go ahead, baby. Like, <laughs> yeah, it feels good. It's like our favorite old black lady phrase, go ahead, baby. And boy, you crazy. Like, it just, it's like the definition of soul. <laughs> I remember the first time I ever heard old black lady encouragement, it was uh, Independence Day, 1996. I was, uh, I, was, I, was at the, I was watching the fireworks display at the park with my family, and there's like families all around. There's like black family behind me, these old black grandmas just sitting back there encouraging the, the fireworks, and it was like, it's hyping everyone else up, because she's like, go ahead, go ahead, 4th of July! And I'm just like, shit! Like, just... <laughs> there was a fucking amped in my life. <laughs> I love old black women, man. They're the best. Just, uh, they play the best music. I used to work in an office, and that was, like, the cool part was, like, just sitting there vibing with people who listen to... Like, I'm such an old man. I listen to, like, the same kind of music. A lot of old-school funk, Zapp and Roger, Parliament, things like that. Like, I find that music so romantic, and I'm gonna fuck so many old black ladies. <laughs> I'm gonna fuck them like this. The whole time she'd be going, go ahead, baby. <laughs> 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 
Fuck yeah. <laughs> All right, uh, that's enough. Thank you guys.